And we're back on episode three of Life is Strange. This is going to be fun. As you can see, it's another day. New shirt. New shirt, new me. Same old personality. I don't know what the freak I'm talking about. Just don't listen to me. Can I get a... Ah! I'm never doing that again. I'm sorry, y'all. So what's happening today? I saw like in the beginning, it looked like we were breaking into something. Like Chloe was lock picking. Are we about to break into the school? Cause it's nighttime. I don't know what for though. I didn't really explain anything. But we gon' play this game. Yeah, it's do not entertainment. Yeah, we finna go crazy. I ain't playing with you, I'm a baby. When, when, when we hit me. Don't hit me, please. Hey, I'm about to run here, please. Hey, tell me what you need to see. Hey, ooh. I'm a baby, but I'm studying that night because my name is Max. Mm. Yeah, keep playing with me. I'm on my IMAX. Dang. Yeah, life is so freaking strange. Remaster episode three. Chaos theory. Like, huzzah! huzzah! Oh, little bunny bunny. Oh wait, is this? Kate! Did she tell me to watch her uh, her bunny? Or is she still in the hospital? I think she's still in the hospital. I'm just watching her bunny while she's gone. I have something to show you. Meet me in front of the campus. I knew Chloe would be all over this. So I better get moving. All right. Let's water the plant. Because we, we cannot forget to water the plant. That's what my mama said. If I forget to water the plant, my mama gonna be mad. Oh, wait. We came home. Oh, I'm sorry, Lisa. I saved Kate, but I drowned my own plant. No! Oh, my gosh. So I wasn't supposed to... Okay. Let's feed the... Are you a hungry bunny? The rabbit. Here. Or bunny. So I already broke my plant, basically. I drowned it. And that's probably a bad decision. Watch. Switch on. Um, look at picture. I'm such an idiot, Kate. I could have shown this to the principal and busted David. I could have. See, this is what I mean. Like, I don't know if that was the right choice, though. Glad the media doesn't waste a second exploiting Kate. Now she has another video of herself all over the web. Arcadia Bay online? Besides Rachel, it's been a while since anybody vanished from Arcadia Bay. Dude. I shouldn't sound so disappointed. I sure hope these people treat her better when she comes back to school. If she does. Either I delete my page or I block everybody. Nowhere to hide these days. All right. So I probably did everybody make- Everybody will be talking about Kate now. Blackwell might as well shut down for the next month. Yeah. So I don't it's know. It's amazing how happy Kate looks here compared to today. She mm. was basically pushed up to that roof, and I will use my power to find out why. This has to end. Yeah. I don't know. I, I'm gonna stick with my decision though, because I, I just feel like <clears throat> me having the ability to like. <sighs> Kate's okay, Max. Take a breath. Kind of have shit um, together. You have time. The security guard around. Oh, maybe this part would have been like if we're sneaking around in the in the in the uh, room. Maybe it would have been easier if the security guard wasn't Jeez, there. So I should have so used it. Freaking tired. <laughs> I sound like a moron. But crime does not delay. I need to stay on top of this investigation. All right, let's continue. Let's get out of here. Dang. No way can I clean that shit off. Time to get Samuel Da Vinci to repaint. All right, let's get out of here. But yeah, I think if we are sneaking around the school, it probably would have been better if he okay, was on this leave. Is scary dark. Let there be light. But at this point, I can't even remake my decision, so we might as well just move with it. Unless I go back. Oh, what the heck? She's awake. Oh, wait, can I go in the bathroom? Oh, there's actually people just awake right now? What are you doing in here? 
Hey, Max. I saw you go up on the roof and save Kate. I can't believe she tried to jump. You can't believe? Comfort Taylor? Blame Taylor? I can. I'm just so glad she didn't. Yeah. Are you okay? I'm just, like, shocked. I've never seen anybody try to kill themselves before. Yeah, don't be pushing people. Like, the freak? I didn't think you'd be so upset considering how much shit you and Victoria gave Kate. I'm my own person, not Victoria's bitch. Yes, you Hello, are. like, she's freaking too. She already broke curfew tonight. <gasps> shit, I'm not supposed to tell anybody. Whatever. Uh, won't say a word? I won't say a word. I swear to dog. <laughs> I believe you, Max. Besides Victoria, you're the only one who asked me about my mom in the hospital. That meant a lot to me. I'm my own person, too. Yeah, talk Let to her. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks. You're, like, weird, but pretty cool, Max. Especially after watching you go up on that roof. Victoria's wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Yep. Talk to you later. So let's go back. Let's see if we can switch up the answer or questions. Hey, Max. Um, I saw you go up on the roof and save Kate. I can't believe she tried to jump. Victoria sneaking out. I know. Victoria must be upset since I saw her sneaking out of the dorm past curfew. Oh, man. Like, you saw her? She was so, like, nervous when she left the dorm. She wouldn't even tell me where she was going. Probably to hell. Ooh. Well, I have to go crash. <laughs> it's been a rough day, as you know. Thanks, Max. And it was, like, pretty awesome when you went up to the roof to save Kate. Victoria Sheesh. was wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Yeah. Talk to you later. Wow, that is crazy. So Victoria snuck out. Oh, Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time. Going through her shit. Ooh, that is so smart. So we can actually get some dirt on Victoria. Let's talk to uh, Dana real quick. Hey, Dana. How are you doing? Better than Kate. I just can't believe she would even attempt suicide. What do you mean you guys can't believe it? Like, are y'all stupid? I'm sorry. I'm getting a little bit, mad, a little bit mad because, like, you're bullying a person to... Like, you know what I mean? She was depressed. We're all responsible. Blame Victoria. Uh, she was depressed. I knew she was depressed, but I had no idea how bad. Must be serious to throw yourself off the roof. Yeah. Why was she on the roof? Kate was serious. That's all you know. So why do you think she was on the roof in the first place? Maybe Kate was so ashamed she got wasted on that video. I don't blame her, but it was pretty gross. Come on, you really believe that Kate Marsh wanted to get drunk at a Vortex Club party? So what exactly are you saying, Max? I'm you saying that- You this something to do with Nathan being expelled? I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure yet, but I'm on it. Weird shit is going down at Blackwell. And I'm going to find out why. I'm getting scared now. But people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like, who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sherlock? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. Ew. This is nasty work, bruv. Can I use this again? Aww. Trevor is a sweetie. Good for Dana. Oh, he's been thinking about you all day. Oh, Trevor wants to be with her. Wait, let me click on the other thing. It's probably something else on the screen. Aww. Trevor, if Dana talks to Juliet about this, she's going to wish she didn't. Oh, gosh, dude. Well, stuff. That is so damn cute how much Dana is into this Halloween party. Alright, let's go check in on... Let's go check in on what's her, what's her name's room. Barricade tape? Oh, wow. So they blocked off her room. 
Wait, it, was there people apologizing? So much hypocrite. Wow. Everybody wants to change up their opinions when someone has to die, bro. Are y'all stupid? This is what I mean by, like, they just, I don't know, bro. It's just sad. All right, let's see what she has in this room. Since I've crossed the line from Snoop to Detect, these socks cost more than my wardrobe. Okay. Search this. I'll title this one, Portrait de la Assholes. Whoa, there's Kate. Whoa. Totally high. She looks confused. Not like she's partying. Yeah, so we have proof. Can we take a picture? No? Okay. I wish we would have took a picture. That would have been nice. Whoa, I had no idea Victoria's parents owned the Chase space. Color me impressed. Victoria is about as straight as me. <laughs> but a unique point of view is right. Excellent, well... Thanks to Courtney Wagner ghostwriting this paper. Unique point of view, Mr. Jefferson. Why are they showing... They're, they're always showing me stuff about Mr. Jefferson, bro, as well. First Rachel and now Kate. This is the end of the Vortex Club. Is that her? Ew. Uh-oh. Search trash can? That's a lot of bank just to clean paint from a sweater. Okay. Anything Victoria's else? Victoria's secret. She's a geek. We're gonna check this drawer. Here they are getting loaded with Satan. Ugh. They like they kind of like siblings, bro. Well, this laptop laptop should have some good oh, information. Victoria and Taylor actually show remorse. Oh shoot. Uh, hey, sweet tea, what's up? I'm just avoiding some lame freaking science homework. How can anybody do freaking homework after somebody almost jumps off the roof? I can't believe we all saw it live. It was like watching a reality show and I've never seen the campus so quiet. Like everyone's hiding or afraid. Yes, I feel like total crap uh, for everything. I said about Kate and the stupid video, let's get some peeps to meet up later. This girl needs a serious curfew cocktail. We'll drink to Kate. What a trip that was today, seeing Max and Kate like that. I need a drink too. Let me know the time. What's the it's time? It's like a thread for sociopaths. Max Crackfield? Lame. From Nathan? Party on, dudes. That Tumo what? Uh, uh, got me effing suspended. Can you believe it? My dad owns the freaking dorm uh, where she plays with her uh, selfies. My parents have lost their crap and are threatening me with a freaking job in my dad's office. How dumb is it to have repping him? Max uh, Crackfield and Blackwell need to go down and the end of the world party is effing. Whoa. Victoria, what the F are you kidding me? That is BS. Um, no way can Blackwell suspend you. I knew that Max was trouble the first time I saw her but kissing mr jefferson when that retro camera uh notice that everyone everybody she hangs around gets in trouble and yes the vortex club will be bringing the end of the world blackwell no matter what i'll okay you later okay does she just like nathan like i understand like bro you're over here selling your Nothing soul see here i guess i shouldn't be so bummed not that Victoria couldn't hide her shit. Man, I'm getting paranoid. I feel like, what if we just didn't find it? You know what I mean? I wish we can check these cameras. That would be nice. I just want to make sure I don't lose anything, because there's proof here. I'll title this one. Poor Whoa, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. There's cameras Not like and stuff she's partying. Here. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else in this room. I just want to make sure we don't... Oh, wait, wait, shoes? Those boots are made for walking runways. Okay. 
I just really want to make sure we don't lose anything. I want to make sure she gets like caught, bro. Here they are getting loaded with Satan. Okay. All right, let's get out of this room. I, I hope we didn't miss anything in here. I really do. Let's leave. Is there anything down here? Missing person. We'll wait for Kate. Oh, so now y'all want to wait for Kate. I want to be here for her. I want to be here for Kate. Everything. Oh, blah, blah, blah. Kids, freaking people in the school are so fake, bro. Waiting for you, Kate. Man. So sick of this crap. Everyone's just lying. Like they really care about her. So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. In front of the main hall? Okay, let me go this way real quick first. A bench. Sit. I feel so giddy, even after Kate almost jumped. Maybe it's the leftover adrenaline. But I feel kind of invincible now. She feels invincible. Okay. Do not know what she means. Can we open this? Oh, it's unlocked. What the freak? I hope Samuel isn't around. Oh gosh, Chloe. Nuts and bolts. I have something to show you. Get that butt in gear now, Max. Like my grandpa's garage. Hold on. Nothing but tools. I'm trying to see if there's like Nothing anything here. useful. Cause why am I able to grow stuff? I know Samuel doesn't wear silky scarves. So who does? What the freak? Magazines? Who knew Samuel was so into runway fashion? Oh, okay. I thought I thought Samuel was Looking at other stuff, man. I was gonna be like, yo, Sam. Why am I able to come in here? Uh, it's probably... Probably that girl stuff thing that's right there. Because that is kind of weird. Like, why is there just a piece of cloth in here under a... Oh, what's it called? Nothing here. Can we go in here? No. Okay. But at least now we know that that's in there. And that could change something. Take a picture of the squirrel. <gasps> oh. oh, maybe I gotta go in the trash. Photo. Look at the lens and say nut. Gotcha. All right. Let's continue. Let's move on down. I'm just trying to make sure I literally have everything. Ah. Wells, oh, are you serious? I'm toast if he sees me. Nobody can expel me. Not yet, anyway. What? Nobody can expel me, not yet, anyways? Really? 
Max the ninja strikes again. Nice. So he was drunk. You saw that he had alcohol out there. He just must be stressing about the Kate situation. And I guess they were trying to get him like gone and sue him probably because of this stuff. But he's drunk out of his mind right now, so he's not going to notice I'm gone. Booyah! Oh, shoot. Chloe, oh my gosh. Like, oh my gosh. Like, I knew it was red. Asshole. Oh hey, my Chloe, gosh, and I that was brown. I exactly have the greatest day trying to keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. Kate saved herself. <laughs> balls to the walls. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Don't I mean, be you so did. modest, rock star. You did something. Kate is alive because of you. You obviously said the right thing. And your badass power is going to save us all. We just need to connect the players. And find out who almost killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? I hope so, don't joke. Chaos theory? I hope so. I hope so, Chloe. But how? Snow and Eclipse are bad omens. This whole town is a bad omen. I noticed that Blackwell seems to be ground zero. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. I think I messed Focus up, y'all. Focus on looking for clues, okay? I think I messed up. About Rachel? Right. For one thing, there's too much coincidence between the people around Kate and Rachel. Like Step Prick and Nathan Prescott? Uh, not just them? Not just them. Yep. I just want to beat the shit out of those particular bros. I can still feel David's hand on my face. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Bro, I have superpowers. Do you, Do you understand that? Kicking it alive? 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 I have to think that, Chloe. Her spirit is so powerful here. Maybe too much power. She's probably in that light tower. Yes, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. What the Thank freak? You, step prick. How did you? you are such oh. A boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. Wow. We should probably sneak into the principal's Thank office. You again so much for helping me put together. A get portfolio. down, get down. Hopefully, the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted, as you know. Ew! It's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day, and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. Ew! I would have done if Katie jumped. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know what's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, Yo. please. Yo! And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. He loves we that butt. We would have spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You Yo. might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. What? As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Yeah, he needs I to get caught. He needs to get caught. 
Are you fucking kidding me? He needs to get caught. They're over here doing nasty stuff. Y'all some nasty people, bro. Look at her. It's so stupid. Look at her stinky butt. She was over here. Ugh. Just I think Victoria can't and I'm glad I didn't get Mr. Jefferson out of here because I would have never known that. Well, I kind of guessed it, Let's but. Let's find out. Ew. That is crazy. Chloe the Keymaster. They probably just got. You know it. Probably just got done, too. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. You can always let me get busted like you did with the weed. Well, I mean, we're I'm fine. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? We get charge us for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. Not if I'm related to the head of Blackwell security. Step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. But my powers didn't save Kate. Maybe I did on my own. Come on. One more door and our work here is done. Alright. Uh, let me look around. Well, I guess there's probably nothing out here for real. So let me get in here. Look at this. I got there's these. no way David would get in Mrs. Grant's face. She'd shut his ass down fast. Wait, uh, is it say Michael or Michelle Michelle Grant? Um, as head of security at Blackwell Academy, it's my job and duty to make sure all the bases have been covered when it comes to protecting the student body i know i'm nobody's favorite among the facility and students but i know i'm making sure their safety is my prime directive uh since taking over as head of security my statistics speak for themselves as does the 15.4 percent uh drop in campus crime i respect your position as a science teacher but you have unfairly de 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 uh, demonize my plan for a surveillance system with a cowardly petition. I hope that you will redact the petition and reconsider the human cause. Okay, I see what you mean. Excuse me. All right, let's check back here. See if we find anything new. Oh hunting hat only a total phony would wear a crappy hat like that okay chloe's taking a while with this freaking door it's okay all right let's see if we can go help chloe with this door because she's 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 lost that's it The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. He's hiding shit, like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door <sighs> open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lockpicking. Oh, Let's shoot. See, Frank, I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. Yeah. We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key, just in case. Okay. Why, yes, I could. Well, let's check in these drawers. Nothing here. Okay. Dead end. It's probably in like the main desk, but we're just gonna check all these just in case. Crap. Because there might be like something in one Boring. of them. All right, let's keep looking down here. Oh, there's a key lock here over here. Keys. None for the principal's office. No key for thee. We have to find another way in. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank. But I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. What if I just... Hey, Warren. You busy? What? Just bubble hearth. You'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. Without naming names, <gasps> if somebody had access to the art and science labs oh, and shoot. wanted to construct a device that would, say, open a locked door, would you maybe kind of know how? 
Huh? No, I'm just asking for fun. Thanks, science guy. So we're gonna melt the lock? Uh, no, 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 stay. We need you as backup. Just send the text instructions now. Yes, I'm still all in to go ape with you at the drive-in. Thanks for the help. <laughs> this sucks ass. Goddamn door. Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? Is Chloe getting jealous? I'm gonna go put it together. Can you stay here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. <laughs> the race is on. See you soon. I didn't even I didn't even get to check the other side of the room. Box. Squirrels like nuts. Does that mean Samuel is nah? <laughs> Take this. Ooh, sugar. Oh. Wait, what's objective? I need to find sugar, a soda can, duct tape, and sodium chloride. Only three more items to go. Sugar, a soda can? Wasn't there trash in here? Oh, it's not in there. Sodium chloride. Okay, I guess we can leave this place. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. So we can find it in the trash, probably? No can here. Dang, no can in the trash? Vending machine. That's probably gonna make too much noise. Nope. Dang, Doesn't bro. Doesn't anybody drink sodas here? Come on. Nothing here. Oh my gosh. Do I really have to order it? Gross. I hate that formal and smell. Exam. An A minus? All right, all right. So Dr. Max did help Warren this morning. Nice. Graffiti. I never said they were great, troll. The aquarium. Why am Everybody's I able to look at this asleep. stuff now? I hate to wake them up, but I want a picture. Turn on. Good evening, fish fish. I guess. Thanks, fish. I, I need to nice remember start. that like this stuff in this game isn't really timed and I don't have to worry about Please resume your slumber. I don't really have to worry about certain things happening. It's just kind of looking around and finding stuff. So sodium chloride is a weed killer. You'd think Warren would have told me that factoid. Is this yeah, I think what we can do is just melt the lock and then uh, I can get in and then on the other side we can just rewind time and I can open it and then Chloe's gonna freaking freak out. Chemistry stuff. You're an artist, damn it, not a scientist. Okay. But this is so not Retailer? sodium chloride. Here's the sodium chloride box. Can you not reach it? Take. You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind power. Use the damn chair. <laughs> Dang, loud, Max? You're halfway home, Max. Cigarette? Yeah, let's take a photo. And then now... Keyword is try, you still there? Did you blow up? <laughs> Max? Still here, didn't blow up. Uh, not yet. I need to concentrate now. I'll talk to you later. Okay. Come on, you're telling me one person didn't have a freaking soda can around here? Let me check. Let me go to the back of the class. We did kind of leave, uh, what's his name class pretty f quick. So maybe he might have a soda can in there. Or I'm really going to have to order from the vending machine. I don't want to do it. But we may have to. <gasps> Ooh, I should go through Mr. 
Mr. What's his name stuff. This is like a scene in a horror film. Please tell me you have something to hear. Oh, Kate. Even when you were sad, you tried to see the good in the world. Shit. Daniel's a better illustrator than photographer, said Max, the art critic. Victoria, that is pretty fucking sweet. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? I'm not gonna lie, that was trash. I feel gross even looking at Nathan's work. Ew. But he does have some style. Is there... Nah, I feel like he has something in this room that we can find, dude. His freaky butt. Over here messing with the cigarette packets. Victoria's cigarettes? <laughs> I'm sure Mr. Jefferson is impressed. Uh, duct tape, nice. The tape is mine. Only one more ingredient left. I'm trying to see if Mr. Jefferson has some freak freak stuff in here, bro, because... But he probably keeps all of his crap somewhere else. Because the, the one thing I can tell you is Mr. Jefferson's not stupid. He's just... I can... He's just weird. Like, I mean, not weird, but I know he's weird. Okay, I have the can. Even messing around with these freaking little girls, bro. Like, now it's time to show Chloe that like, I know, I think the they're of age, but still, bro, you're the teacher, dude. It's just weird. Hey, she still hasn't got it yet. All right, Chloe, watch out. Pipe Take it bomb. Easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Boom. Literal. Yo! Yes. Time to blow shit up. Uh, if you'll light the candle. Y'all better run. So cool. Get ready to haul ass. Yo, <laughs> yo, get down! What the freak? That so fucking cool. All right, let me in there. Let me in there so I can rewind. Oh, we are toast. Here comes the whole arcade. Wait, wait. Fire and police department. Uh, so what should we do? Uh, just wait. Let me get in the room. Do, 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 do. Okay. Boom. There we go. All right. And now let's unlock this. this bastard open. <laughs> I can't cheat with a rewind. Oh, this is bullshit. <laughs> Welcome to my domain. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you Low did key, it. I kind of wish I looked through the, the room before I, I let her in. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. Man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money, but no taste. How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? What does that mean? I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be at Blackwell. Eat me. I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly ass desk. Dang, are they really just like, I can't search okay, around? Sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair? I would have never let her in. This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock. Find us some clues about Rachel or Kate or Nathan. Anybody. I'm on the case. All right, thank you. I was about to say, I wish I could, like, couldn't, like, just wouldn't have let her in so I can actually look through this Kate files. Warren. This pretty much sums up Kate. Shy and sweet. And in the wrong place. GPA 3.9. Bro, who's texting me? Warren? So did you blow the lock up? Oh, please. I just wanted to see if uh, you knew your explosives and to see your incredible artwork. Okay. Only two more files to go. Search this. Doesn't look like anything. I certainly can't use this. Books. This is not really anything important. Browser. This will so not come in handy. Whiskey bottle. 
I'd drink too if I was the principal of Blackwell. <laughs> nothing in oh and yeah. nothing here. She's over here scrolling on his computer. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. But there's not much here about the police investigation. Dang, Rachel was a 4.0 student? Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Oh, shoot. Bad, Chloe. Dang, Let's Chloe. nab this last file, Sherlock. Always wanted to say... Weird. This asshole has a spotless record. Wow. Like I'm not gonna read my own personal file. Wow. This file is going to be so spotless, I'll projectile vomit. <laughs> I have to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background. I think we found everything in here. I should go join Chloe now. Uh, what if I want to keep looking? So, Nathan Prescott's dad is a bully too. Shocker. So he was... Wait, in the light... In, in light of... Wait, in light of the recent outrageous allegations against my son and his suspension, I feel that my large contribution to Blackwell Academy should also be suspended. So he's trying to take away their funds. You're not so tacky up close. What is this? That is so cool that my signature actually counted. Go, Miss Grant. Oh, nice. I feel like us not giving Miss Grant the ability to put, or like giving her dad the ability to use those cameras might make things worse. But then again, since he has like all reviews over the cameras, it's probably a good thing that we did that. But let me, student files. I think we looked at everything. I don't think there's anything in the desk I can look at. We speak to Max, Chloe. you better come check out these files. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus, and my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Wow. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Nathan Prescott the third. Ooh, he's so money. And you know the Prescotts dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Open it. It's just some crazy drawing. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. What? Over and over. That's it. That's fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa, listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. <laughs> it's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling Can we take me, photos of this? And now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. <laughs> it's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. We should definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Holy shit! Jackpot! Cha-ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. Yo. I said chill him out after our knife showdown yesterday. Are you going to make a big issue out of this? Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. Leave the money, steal the money? There's no point in taking it. Just leave it. You really want to take money from the handicapped fund? I know you need to pay Frank back, but I've got my power to protect you, right? There's a lot of power in that horse-choking wad of cash. But yes, Moral Max is right again. I guess. 
Bro, don't Let's be get mad. Get the hell out of this office, Morg. I know that money would have helped Chloe and me. Yeah, but we're basically stealing. It's gonna give us some bad morale, bro. So we're not doing it. That impish look scares me. Care for a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is ours. Oh swimming? my gosh. You wanna take that risk now? It's been a cray week. You didn't let me take that money to pay off Frank, so if he pops a cap in my skull, at least allow me to have a little carefree fun for a few minutes. Splish Splash? You're right. We hella deserve it. Splish Splash. Max! Did you actually just say hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. Max is gonna get us in trouble too. Like, I understand we're friends and stuff like that, but bro, we are in the academy late at night. Did we get out? Oh, we're going in right now, dude. Close the door at least. We're in the otter's lair. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? I still go to school here. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. Chloe is so psyched for girls night out, so I better follow her evil plan. The trophies. Go otters. Go otters. The vending machine. I would love a soda, but I just get wired. <laughs> Woman's locker room. Maybe we should get a soda because I don't trust that this is going to be a good idea. If only I could solve the mystery of the missing cat pics. <laughs> what the frick are they talking about? Men's room. Uh, Chloe, are we going to continue? Is there anything like special in here? Why do they make me look around like this? All right, Chloe, let's go. Boys or girls? Boys or girls locker room. If I go into the boys locker room, I could probably find. Does Nathan even swim? Let's go to the boys. Boys, of course. Figures. Perv. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. Uh. Let's see. I guess somebody forgot their Blackwell spirit. Because we can search through this whole place and see if there's actually like stuff in here e-cigarettes some poor hipster lost their vape warren's locker betty developed that in jefferson's Aww. class but why bro what do you mean but why max you act like he doesn't like you zachary's jersey no way am i touching zach's jersey cell phone zach is really careless doesn't oh. he know what happens when i'm around Victoria Chase, hey, thinking bad things about you. Whoa! Wait, cool, what are you wearing? Uh, just my crystal necklace and phone? Hot, what are you wearing? I'm in locker room, only wearing a jersey, sitting on my football. Ugh. Floats. This must be for training kids. Nathan's locker. It's okay for Nathan to be hooked on these drugs. Oh right? my gosh. Dias Dias Dia Dias Diapam? Wait, what is Diapam? Hold on, I wanna actually see what that is. Cause it what if like these drugs are actually like sleep pill type it's drugs? It's okay for Nathan to be hooked on these drugs. So we have right? Is it Yeah, Di uh, da, 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 da. D dias, diapam can cause paranoid or suicidal I ideation and impaired memory, judgment and coordination. Combining with other substances, particularly alcohol, can slow breathing and possibly lead to death. <laughs> and then what is this one? Because they said in combination. So we have rest. I think it's this one. Uh, is it risk 
Risperidone? I don't even know, dude. It can treat schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, and um, caused by autism. What the freak? So he's addicted to these, or is he like actually he has bipolar and all that stuff? Wow. I wish you would take pictures of this. Sometimes. Ew. Logan's locker? I guess I should consider this evolution. Uh, Dana, I'm on the... Wait. I can't even see what that said. I guess I should consider this evolution. Dana, I know I'm an a-hole, but I still care about you. Love, Logan. Ew. Disgusting, bruv. Graffiti on the wall. A, a Victoria huh, loves... Nice to know Victoria loves something besides herself. Wow. Max is a feminazi? Welcome to 1950. I love Warren. Okay. Can I look at it? I bet you do. Dana needs a baby daddy. <laughs> what the freak? Look. Max Caulfield, moral avenger. Or self-righteous hypocrite. Alright, so let's go back and let's go check the woman's locker now. Boys or girls? Let's go into the girls', girls locker. Of course. Girls. Ooh la la. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. All right. So now we are in the girls' locker, and you know the girls' locker is gonna have some Where drama in it. Where does that other sock go? Looks like Brooke wants to go to the drive-in with Warren. Oh. Shoot, I mean... I wonder if Max even really likes Warren like that. Those are some musty-ass old shirts. Yuck. Others eat... Otters eat beavers? The wit. It burns. Ooh, Victoria's locker. So, Victoria's secret is selfies. <laughs> Go fuck your... No. Jefferson said, don't confuse art with the artist. These are cool shots. Why are you freaking defending Jefferson? Did you not just see them together over here getting, getting weird? Those look like the most cozy, comfy towels in towel history. Flippers. Want flippers in a swimming pool? Are they training Navy frogmen here? Kate's locker. A bus ticket? Was Arcadia she going Kate. to run away? One Portland trip like ticket? Like Amber? Whoa. Oh wait, that's all in here? Dang. I thought there was going to be more. Wait, Brooks? Oh, wait, I already read Brooks. Yeah. I thought there was going to be so much more in the girls' locker room. But no. It's actually quite normal. Victoria Chase rules. This isn't a desperate cry for attention or anything missing person poster sorry Rachel Rachel abides I hope so friend dear Kay I don't care well we care dickhead whoa Mm. 
nah, dude, saying that on 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 the Lord, bro, is nuts. That is Hello, crazy gorgeous. dirty work. <laughs> you wish, Max. Ooh, pink goo. I see why everybody brings their own soap. I didn't really find like much in there. I thought it was gonna be like something crazy. Oh wait, I could have just went across the room. Oh, hold on. In case I run out of air, I know where to come. So this is a control cabinet. Yes, we get it. Otters. Why is that person bald on the right side? A cup. Coffee and swimming. Good combo. Why is there a full cup of coffee here? Is someone was someone in here? Aw, look at the baby Halloween pumpkin. Can I look at it? So, the big plan is... win. Okay... I thought I was gonna like find something... a little fishy in here. No pun intended because it's the water, but... I genuinely thought I was gonna find like something. I don't like, think something. anybody has ever drowned here. I hope. Anything back here? Don't touch. Guessless? Looks like I'm the Vortex Club bouncer. Decisions, decisions. I'm just searching all around here because there could be literally anything hiding. And like, I'm not a completionist, but like, a game like this, you have to really look around. Because you can miss one piece of little evidence, and you're cooked. But I think we have everything. Alright. Alright, let's talk to Chloe. I think we found everything that we needed to. Max, try to find the light for the pool. I want to see the sharks. Otters don't like sharks. They bite. <laughs> so do I. Hit that light. All right, Clo Clo. Chloe. There has to be a control panel for the light. Switch on. Here. She's had extra clothes or she just strip into her underwear. Should I push her in? I was about to say. You gonna jump in, Clo? Uh. Time to do or dive, Max. Oh, I can choose? What do you mean? Chloe? Oh. Oh yeah, baby. Feels like a hot tub. Too bad you made me feel like the queen of assholes because I wanted that cash stash. Tell me you're not gonna stand there watching me like a zombie. Don't you dare! Come stop me, hippie! Okay, you asked for it. Oh, I guess no, we're just stripping that. down into our freaking... <laughs> our undergarments. Why look, an otter in my water. Dun 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 dun. You are so obvious. And I still get freaked out by that movie, so stop. I can't even watch any of those shark shows. <laughs> oh, look at our two best friends. <laughs> I'll just rewind and harpoon you. Otter's revenge. Cheater. Yeah, you wouldn't know about that. <laughs> I wish Rachel was here. She would totally love being in here at night. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. 
With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related, and I want to find out for Dude, Kate's being sake. able to float like that is crazy. She almost died today. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. You know what I mean. You're becoming like this force of nature. More like luck of nature. Come on, my power failed trying to rescue Kate. Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. For what reason? You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. Ah, uh, what if I did? You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. What if I did? I mean, technically, to tell the truth. Thank God. But what if I had? What if Kate didn't jump, but you would be dead? So it's time to start moving forward in time. And we're obviously connected, since without me, you would have never discovered your power, right? Uh, I don't know, actually. I don't know. I don't know. Well, I do, okay? So, just listen to Captain Chloe. I'm trying. No. As long as we don't waste I don't, this power. I don't really Stop remember. Stop being so goddamn humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. I don't remember More me figuring Rachel out my Amber. power because of her. Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? And I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. Warren is nice. You're the bro killer. Gross. Warren is nice. <laughs> nice? Ouch. That means friend zone. No, he's really cool. It was so sweet when he stood up to Nathan. But I haven't told him about my rewind power. No worries. Once you get over yourself, you're going to make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. Now I'm getting cold in here. Because we're yapping instead of attacking each other, Otter versus Shark style. I uh, think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's check. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. I thought they warmed it up. This. I feel like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. You would know. Whoa. Hi. Oh my gosh, it's her father. We have to go now. What the freak? Make sure you cover the whole perimeter. How did he just teleport? Dude, hide. Like when we were kids. Oh, I can use my power. Or just look for a hiding spot. Or both. Where are they? Hello? Is he inside? Hello? Anybody there? I can't turn! Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. I heard something over here. Who's here? I got I got a flashlight and a stick. Hey!
Is there two of them? Did y'all see that? Was there two of them? We are so invisible. Let's bail. It looked like there was two of them going outside. Unless that was just a reflection, I can't tell. Wait, turn around. They're coming. We have to find another way out. Oh, this is bullshit. You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer I just busted lives so I'll be safe? Okay. Into the car! Get in! <laughs> Later, fuckers! Max, you rock! Loud so freaking car! Awesome. <laughs> yes, we so are. What the heck, dude? I feel like he's gonna know your truck, though, Max. Like, or, uh, Chloe. He has surveillances at home. He can easily see that you're back home. This is just a lose-lose situation. Are they sleeping naked? I was about to say. Take selfie? Okay. Always remember this moment. Photo bomb! Z Photo hog. It feels like a different world from yesterday. We left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. Ooh. Like it needs another one. I'd like to do something good for my school in Arcadia Bay. I can't even submit my photo to represent. I just don't want to be rejected. Every great artist gets rejected before they get accepted. So you have to enter a photo. Even though I'm pimping the school in town you want to torch? Come on, I don't want to see Arcadia Bay burn to the shore. I just say shit like that because I've been trying to get out of here since... since you left, basically. If I could find Rachel, then pay Frank off. I'm still leaving to start a whole new life. I wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. Oh, does the schoolgirl have a test today? I'm starting to feel like going to Blackwell every day. Don't be giving no, me no copyright, please. Oh my gosh. No, get up. Get up. We're not we're not sitting in this copyright. Mm -mm. Where's the radio at? Talking about turning up the taxis. We can't turn it off? Oh my gosh, she loves the copyright. Okay. Alright. Incident fire department. Responded to a break-in and a vandalism. Police have not stated. Oh wow! Following a public suicide threat at Blackwell, Kate Marsh is reportedly in a stable condition under supervision at Arcadia Bay Med Center. Nice. Good dress. See if you can find a suitable outfit in my fashion hole. Alright. Let me look around real quick before we do that. I'm so damn 
She's really trying to suss out what my vision is. Mm-hmm. Then we have this. I might put up a pick of you instead. Can't compete with Rachel. Holy shit, Mom. Chloe, money now. I don't have your money yet. Uh, what is her pictures? This is my last message. I'll get it. Now, you freaking... Okay. Examine. Wow. Look at... Wait. Wow. Totally different. Can we turn this song off? I don't even know if I'm voice acting this for y'all or not, or if y'all just reading. The butterfly. Gentleman IR, don't be a dummy, cover your willy. Are these... I don't know whose stuff that is, but okay. Wow. I remember this old song. We decorated it together. Closet. Let's check the drawer. I don't think I'll be blushing today. Um... I think that's everything, and we still can't turn this music off. Can I turn this off? Man! They really want me to, uh... To listen to this song, dude. Let's open this. Okay. Time for some Chloe cosplay. Hey, there you go! Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. Choose your side. But not quite my side. What if, like, it was, like, a time yeah, loop and no, Rachel wasn't even it. real? Like... Rachel was just like me when I was gone, like literally. Always rewind back to your chlorine brand t shirt into their jeans. He sucks. I like me certain things. But it would be cool to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. Stop second guessing yourself, Max. Put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford a suit cancer whenever and whatever you want to try. For example, I dare you to kiss me. See, I think something's I up. Dare you. Kiss me up. I was getting, I was giving, I was literally getting a feeling that something was weird about these two. They seemed oddly close to each other in that way. I'm gonna see what happens. Cause they kept- Damn, you're hardcore, Max. Now I can text Warren and tell him he doesn't stand a chance. Unless he's into girl and girl action. You're such a dork. That will have. I, that was priceless when I kissed Chloe. She didn't think I would. See, I, I, there's that is so random. That's why I feel like there's something weird about that because I I felt like there was something weird between them. The way they okay. were talking, I thought it was Time just like girl talk. But uh, there'd be times hey, where they'd be like, go. "Oh yeah, she's so freaking Rachel cute. She's so hot." With me. She's like, don't kiss. Sorry, not that easy. Oh, like I am? Just admit that you already macked on me, then used your rewind. Now I can Whoa. text Warren that you're saving yourself all for him. I am so going to best unfriend you for that. I love this... that Chloe is so fearless. In reality, in my mind, I wouldn't kiss her. So let's just keep it at that. We're freaking friends. I don't know how girl code works. Girls, if y'all watching this, do y'all just be kissing your girlfriends like that? Like, that's what y'all do? Is that a normal thing? Like, I, am I, if I get this wrong because I didn't kiss Chloe, like, what? I'm not trying to have no freaking weird sick, relationship Max? with Chloe. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, Shaka bra? Maybe not. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast? Maybe that was a... To, uh, wake and bake first. Maybe that was a way for... I promise not to tell. Let's not rewind and Max find out, to okay? kind of get her revenge on like, oh, um, I'm I'm better than Rachel type of thing. I love this morning light, it's so peaceful. Wouldn't it be wicked if we could just hang out here forever like when we were kids? Yes, but sadly we're not kids anymore. At least you can date now, right? 
My dad was terrified of the day I would discover boys. A boy? Did you have a boyfriend? So, you never really told me if you had a serious boyfriend while I was away. Not serious. I was stupid, usually. I went through a boy toy phase. Among other things. I can't see you with any of the guys around here. Because you have a good eye. That's why I was so glad Rachel came along to rescue me. You crushed on Rachel? Was Rachel that popular? Sounds like you totally crushed on Rachel. You would have too. Smart, sexy, and sassy. Okay, me, so right? she's... Well, duh. <laughs> maybe Rachel would have fought over both of us. You wish. Alright, so they're they're both again, maybe. into boys they're and girls. And I'm guessing. So she had like a little relationship with with Rachel. So that makes a lot of sense. And I'm not in that relationship. Which is perfectly fine because we are freaking friends. When Rachel comes back, you can go date oh Rachel all God. you want. That smells so amazing. Oh, Kate. Whoa, gosh, Kate. Uh, Max, thank you from my for from my heart for reaching out to me on the roof. You're the only one who was there for me at school. The only one who truly cared. I have to believe you were sent to give me hope. You did so much more than that. My father is grateful as well. You'll always be in our prayers. Love and blessings. Your friend Kate. Hey Kate, I'm so glad you're okay. I will visit you as soon as I, c I can. Promise. It's like when we were kids here. Look. I better not go in there. David might be in bed. Ew. Photo? Oh, the bird's in here. How long has this bird been in the house? No way. That's the bluebird I saved Monday in Joyce's room. Chloe has had this damn dirty pirate towel since we were kids. Ugh. <laughs> Serious flashback. You know, I haven't gone through a dyeing my hair blue phase yet. Maybe it's time. Uh, toothbrush? Feels so good to wash my face after all that chlorine. And hiding use what's ironic is i always hated it when chloe used my toothbrush i mean i guess y'all are best friends i don't know man couldn't do it personally but you know it might oh wait can i let the bird out oh, i guess it's too late now I go upstairs? I guess not. This might be the one time these people are right. Okay. Answering machine. I can play this? David, this is Officer Corn. Just want to let you know, your stepdaughter's car was identified Ooh. near the Blackwell campus last night, around the time of the break-ins. What? Give me a call <sighs> soon. Are you in trouble again, Chloe? Don't you sleep? <clears throat> okay. Let's rewind that. Because I don't want to get Chloe in trouble. So we're going to erase this. Message deleted. Goodbye, message. I think Chloe has earned a break from all this bullshit. Uh, Chloe still eats the same cereal. So do I. Oh, man. I don't want to be famous for this. Flash snow and freak eclipse apocalypse soon. Super heroin save suicidal Blackwell student. Did I read that wrong? Did I say heroin? Who drinks beer this early around here? Well, I guess freaking... What's his name? That boy upstairs. Boy trapping out the john. Uh-oh. Sliding door. I still haven't went outside. Can I go outside? Ooh. 
What is out here? The swing. I guess there's like another, uh, there's a basketball up here. I guess there's like another sequence where we can hear what Max got to say. I remember when Chloe and me would take turns in the swing. Yeah. We would push each other so hard we'd fly way up in the air. Chloe always wanted to swing all the way around. I always got scared and would jump off before I flew off. And Chloe is still trying to get high. Oh shoot, yeah, I'm not getting stuck. Guys, when I tell y'all, they put you guys in like a trance right here. I stayed there for like a good freaking two to three minutes thinking that there was a cutscene gonna happen. Uh. All right, let's talk to, oh, window, open. I keep expecting to see the sky turn red. Okay. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. All right, let's say hi to Mama Joyce. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel. Ah, uh, I mean Max. Who you startled me? Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. Uh, pancakes. Pancakes. I'm dying for some of your famous pancakes. I thought you would have missed those. Ah, you ate more than William, and he loved them. <laughs> I remember. We would erase each other to grab them from the stack. So this time, you can help me with the ingredients. I need you to grab me the eggs and milk. Eggs and milk? No problem. All right. Oh. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. Okay, I guess it's not in there. Oh, the milk is right here. Now for the mother's milk. Where the eggs at? Oh, she just got them. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. Ingredients. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but... We are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. Uh, is Rachel okay? Rachel in trouble? Was Rachel mad at Chloe? Uh... Is there any reason that Rachel might be mad at Chloe and left without her? Chloe could piss everybody off but her. They were almost joined at the head. Reminded me of you and Chloe. But Rachel wasn't as grounded as you. I'm grounded? Since when? Maybe that's why Chloe likes Rachel so much. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? Uh, maybe. maybe. Rachel was so much cooler than me. Oh, you think? Then why has Chloe been telling me she wishes she could be more like you over the past five years? Doubt it. Um, did she really? Five years ago feels like a thousand now. And that makes me what, a century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, youth. <laughs> if only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila, a breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> Go sit at the table. All right. Good thing I didn't, or Max didn't freaking kiss, uh, kiss her. Cause I don't know. I feel like that would have gave the wrong f vibes. If that makes sense. Like, I don't know. Look. Okay. 
Oh, shoot. Can I get up? I didn't know the freaking, um... Thank you so much, Joyce. I'm never leaving this table. Good, you can clean. <laughs> I didn't know the bird was in here. What is she looking for? All right. Look at the news. Oh man, I don't want to be famous read that. for this. I guess nobody waters the plant here. I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. Okay. Can I get up? Seeing you again. Ah, oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Mm-hmm. Wow, sir. I totally remember that day. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this, and... and... I know, Joyce. Dang. I'm sorry. That in a car crash? I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive, and everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Uh-oh. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always about you. Chloe, please, it's too early to start picking a fight. Heed instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Yo! No one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me, I have to use the bathroom. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. Now who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. Dang. I do need to get into David's computer. He's gotta be hiding shit. Yeah, but like we don't know the password. No shit, it needs a password. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Uh, we had something in the drawer. We never got to search this yet. Okay. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. No. The freak. Oh, I guess they're family? Stepdad? Oh, shit balls. I don't know why you thought that was a thing. Oh shoot, my camera died. Power 321. Uh check the cupboard. Nothing to see here. If I was... Padlock? Naturally, David would buy a heavy-duty military padlock. I can even see the combination. That might be a useful password. Ooh, 7171. Nothing in it. Uh, padlock? Chloe can't get another gun now. Unless she steals it back from Frank. Whoa. 
Oh. I could try the license number for the password. There we go. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. Oh wait, what about his, does he have like dog tags in his room or something? I swear I saw a dog tag somewhere. Oh, or was that upstairs? Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? Tape? Whoa. Obviously, David's parents care about him. Oh, okay. That date might be a good password. True. Plate. Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. <laughs> Why not? I feel like David isn't. Well, I don't know. I was gonna say I feel like David That's isn't cute. that bad. Could be a password here. Survey company. A knife. Even David Madsen might be an angel to somebody else. Search. Oh, wow. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. <laughs> it was an honor having you in the di uh, diner. Nice to know that gentlemen still exist. Love to talk again with you soon. By the way, the name is Joyce, if you forgot. That might be a useful password. Dang, there's a lot of things. Now the car looks ready to roll. This is a better hobby for David than surveillance. Yeah. Wish he would stick to it. David has been dragging his head around since 2001. Uh, I mean, I haven't really seen how he reacts to Joyce, but just kind of like thinking about it. I feel like he loves Joyce, so we'll try personal no family let's try this one yes Four. oh Max my gosh strikes again whoa spoiler alert rachel definitely hooked up with frank whoa <sighs> but why does david care Rachel Anvil profile rachel has been cutting glass all week frank and rachel meet once again rachel avoids her Wow, Arcadia police report. So he's like kind of doing reports on on people in Instead of doing surveillance. Kate, David could have helped her. KM follows same path to every class. Overheard Kate and Dana were talking about supplies for Vortex Club party with drugs. So Kate and Dana Watch Kate with her church group. She knows her Bible. Kate stays in the bathroom longer than the other students. Saw Kate helping Jefferson after class. Don't trust grown men with goatees. So he doesn't trust him either. There's a lot of, lot of, whoa, there's a lot of stuff in this hall. Let me make sure I take pictures because this is nice. So he doesn't trust Jefferson. Kate has uh, kept to herself since Vortex Club. Not even church, drugs. Tried to talk to Kate about the party. She got upset and ran guilty. Okay, so this is so wrong. This is oh, me. Creepy bastard. I don't think her dad's that bad. I think he's just be doing what Marines do, or like what he used to do. Uh. Okay. I better tell Chloe about this now. Is there anything else I can see? Whoa! Spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Let me take Frank. a picture of this too, just in case. But why does David care? Uh. All right. So now that we did all of that,
Alright, I just wanted to see if there was anything else I can do. So, what I did right there was basically made sure that the computer was off. So let's go talk to Miss Lady at the table. Oh, shoot. Nice breakfast. David, you, you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. What happened? Some little shit-ass punks broke into the swimming pool. <laughs> this is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Do you know for sure it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. Mm. Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know oh more about gosh. it than me. No, you and Chloe think you know more than anybody, like all teenagers. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras so he can spy on us. Yo, everybody. what is happening? Like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not. Now, yo, Chloe. you used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? Side with David, side with Chloe. Bro. Why are we having this argument right now? Oh, gosh, okay. I don't know David. I don't know David. All I know is that he was genuinely trying to figure out things with that. But at the same time, there was some weird stuff with Nathan. I'm just going to side with Chloe. You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even hit your stepdaughter. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Chloe was doing drugs. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What, what the freak? Is this true, Max? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Oh, Whoa. you're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. Well, screw you. David, you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, oh David. Oh, my God. And in my name. You know the law, right? Oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm outflanked. <laughs> Have a nice day. Chloe, for once, just please shut up. Yo. I, I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. Can I speak to him? I don't want to see or hear you again, Max. You've hurt me and my family enough. All right, so let me go back. Let me see if what happens if we side with him because I kind of don't want to like make them go against each other because I, I kind of did want to side with don't. the security guard. I didn't think she was going to say that stuff. Let me see what she says. Listen, we don't know that David did anything and nobody has any proof against him. As far as we know, it's Nathan Prescott who's the real threat so far. I would cut David slack here. Oh, would you? How generous, King Max. So suddenly it doesn't matter how shady David has been acting, or that he keeps all those weird files on your classmates, or how you're always going off on how creepy David Enough. is. I don't want anybody being accused of anything. There's been too much of that crap going on around here lately, and I don't want it in my home today. Well, I agree with that. Now, if you all don't mind, I'd like to forget about work and sit down and eat some of this incredible grub. I have to take a dump. Are you coming, Max?
Maybe I went too easy on David for Joyce's sake. <sighs> Let me think about this, man. This is so difficult to really make a decision. Because... The thing is... In the case files that he was filing, it wasn't really saying anything like, oh, I want to, I'm doing something to Kate or like anything like that. It gave me the vibe of, listen, these things are happening. I'm investigating these things and that's it. Like, try to talk to Kate about the party. She got upset and ran guilty. Okay, so that does seem kind of weird, but hold on. Rachel Amber has been cutting class all week. Incident report, Rachel Amber 18 was picked up at 2 Blackwell Academy for possession of a controlled substance. That was reported. What is her trying to hide or... Found it contained various illegal pharmaceuticals. See attached page for full thing. You know what's funny? I kind of want to go with... I kind of want to go with keeping him on our good side. Because I don't know what is happening. I don't know yet. He obviously doesn't trust Mr. Jefferson from the Kate files. I think I'm going to stick with this one. Let me see what he says. Thanks again for defending me, Max. But this is my family now. What do you mean? Max, I appreciate you sticking up for David. And our family. Even if Chloe doesn't. Let me... Chloe's gonna be so mad at me, but... I, I gotta see. Thanks for letting me down again, Max. Why can't you just rewind so I don't have to see you defending that asshole? Chloe, if I keep doing what you want me to do, it's just not going to be good. Space to leave Chloe's house? Oh, so I just got to leave now. I'm going to stick with that decision. I know you guys are probably like, bro, why are you doing that? Judging from the files, yes, Please. he is weird. When I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not going to believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that going to prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker, I think I made the, I think I made the right choice. Sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shipples. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh... What the freak? I'm so lost. Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. <laughs> now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. All right, so let's go inside. What the frick is that? But no, I think I did make the right choice. And the reason why... Oh. What is going on here? Why is there so many birds? What the frick? There's another one. Another one? Tornadoes, snowfall, eclipses, now dying animals. Holy another shit. bird. This is so creepy. Okay. Uh, window. Deja vu. There's dust on the dust now. <laughs> yeah, okay. So, 
like I was saying, I think I made the right choice. Mainly because uh, we can use that for information. And plus, I also told, what's her name, the info Good that morning. I needed, so it How doesn't matter. Fish today? Don't ask. First the snow, then an eclipse. What's next, the tornado? Climate change, I hope not. You don't not. think it could be like climate change or something? Climate sure has changed around here. Just saw that Prescott brat having a fit by himself in the parking lot. Isn't he always having a fit? He ain't the only one. You knew what was going on with the fish around Arcadia Bay. Sorry, I'm too pissed to talk about it. I know. See you around, kid. See you, fisherman. Oh, wait. Good morning. Don't. Climate change fish. I heard that something bad was happening to the fish in Arcadia Bay. Well, since you mentioned it first, there ain't no fish in Arcadia Bay. Whoa. <laughs> what? Come on. None? They're all None dying. None worth catching and eating anymore. I'm not shitting you. Salmon, trout, bass have died and migrated. Even the damn clams are dying. Oh Dang. But what about... Sorry, just too salty to talk about it. See you around, kid. So that's why all the animals are dying, too. Let me see if homeless woman is behind the uh, trucker. What's up, dude? Hey, how's it going? Peachy. Interview over. Okay. Uh, worst interview. Having a bad day at the office? Work is dried up around here, and I have bills to pay. Time is money to a guy like me. That sucks. Wish I could drive right out of Arcadia Bay. Whole town is crumbling. Snow, eclipse. And a slut trying to commit suicide. Yo! Maybe you should leave then. What if I could? Now even that shifty Rachel What's her face asked me once if I drive her to Los Angeles. You knew Rachel Amber? Can you tell me about her? Nope. Christ, why don't you get a real job instead of homework? All right, let's I'd rewind. Love to see you Blackwell turds try to drive my 1977 Needham 18 wheeler out there. Like I said, interview over. All right, let's go back and rewind the. But I would love to drive your car, and hopefully, I pray that we can steal hey, it, dude. Peachy. Uh, 1977 Needham. Actually, I wanted to ask if that's your bitch in 1977 Needham 18 wheeler out there. How the hell did you know that? Uh, Blackwell class, Rachel Amber. My friend Rachel Amber told me about this cool rig in town because I love taking pictures of truckers. You knew Rachel. She sure didn't give a rat's ass about truckers or real work. Oh, so you must have known her too? Only from the diner. She was just a gold digger. She belonged in California with all those you know who know <laughs> what. Good riddance. Wow. But you can take pictures of my truck anytime. Take care. All right, cool. Let's go do it. Uh, unless I get, oh wait, can I do it from here? I was going to literally cross the street and probably get hit by a freaking car. Uh, we already seen the newspaper. Another dead bird. What the so freak? Ominous. Are we just going to ignore the ground having a tornado attack or is that an or is that bugs? More dead birds. Another dead bird. Let's talk to Lady of Wisdom. Hi, how are you? I remember you. I heard about that girl almost jumping off the Blackwell roof. Kate. Kate Marsh. I was able to actually talk her down from the roof. That was you? If I had a bottle, cheers. <laughs> Thanks. Wish I had a bottle for you. But I need to find out who else is involved in this. I'm probably a bigger snoop than you. People pretend to not see me, so I see everybody and everything. Nathan David Madsen. 
Frank. Oh. I think Joyce's husband David has something to do with all this. No, I don't. He's an uptight ass. But I think he just wants something to do. Like make life hell for me and his family? Sounds like you know a lot more than me, child. I just think Arcadia Bay is in trouble. Maybe you'd like to tell me what you're hiding. I feel like I can trust you as much as Chloe. And you wouldn't think I'm crazy. Too late for me to judge anybody. Plus, you're not crazy. I'm just gonna say this. I had a vision of Arcadia Bay being destroyed by a tornado. For real. Could be. Bad mojo is in the air this week. Thanks for the warning, Max. This action will have consequences? For me telling her the truth? Thanks for that storm warning, Max. And, uh, I'll let you know if I find out anything. Alright, thank you. I don't know, I felt like I trusted her enough, but... Maybe that was a wrong play, but I, I don't know. I, what is she gonna say? She's a, she's a homeless woman? I feel like maybe people won't even really believe what she's talking about, maybe? So we should... By the way, wait, hold on. By the way, dang! By the way, the drive is in actually. Wait, is. The drive in is actually popular, so I'm buying the ticks now. I'll let you take care of the popcorn. In other words, you can't back out now. Okay, it's officially sold out, but I managed to get us both tickets. Had to fight a dozen bullies off for them, uh, though, freaking nerds. Okay, cool. What the freak is she talking about? What? There she is, Super Maxine. That's your new nickname around the bay. Sorry, but you did earn it. We're all real proud of you for helping Kate down. Thanks, Officer Barry. I was just lucky. And right on time. Kate is who counts. I'm glad you're representing Blackwell Academy. Weird town. Next. David Madsen. Nathan Prescott? I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. What well, the fuck? Don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. 
Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him. What's that the deal? I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. Whoa. Got some information. There she is. Thanks, I'm... I'm... Uh, next? Previous? What? Nathan Prescott well, deal. I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. Ooh. Try interrogating somebody else. You can use this you. key information with either Frank or Nathan or Officer. What can I do for you, Max? Kate Marsh. I guess Kate Marsh will be the face of Blackwell for a while. And you for helping her. That's the kind of school spirit we need more of. David Madsen? I feel like David Madsen represents Blackwell. Not for long. He's a loose cannon. We all respect him for his service, but he's too eager. He's eager to be a dick to me and Chloe. That's true. He was ranting about a stolen gun, then I tuned out. Somebody's always out to get him. Wow. Look how much info we're just getting from this one cop, dude. Holy crap. What can I do for you? Uh, David Madsen? I feel like... Not for long. He's eager... That's true. Oh, okay, I guess can't use that here. Alright, so let's see... Let's talk to Nathan. Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh... Oh, look! Max Amber! Nice outfit. By the way, thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you twee bitch. You're lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public I'm not even scared of with Nathan a police anymore. officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. Your father. <laughs> uh, drugs for sale? Next. Cops information, Rachel and Frank. We'll see. I bet you hoped that Kate Marsh would stay quiet. Idiot says what? Did you drug her? You are so stupid, Max. You think you're so goddamn smart, too. Don't push me, girl. You don't want me for an enemy, understand? Do you? Calm down, dude. We're in the diner. Right. Plus, you're an adult now. I can sue your dumbass for libel. Thanks. Now fuck off, Dyke. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, what do you want now? <laughs> uh, uh, your father. Your sugar daddy will always protect you. And threaten me. You don't know shit about my father or me. Nobody here does. Then tell me what I should know. Why? So you can pretend to care, hmm? Spoiler alert, he's an asshole. Ooh. Maybe I could help you. I don't need you for anything except to stay out of my fucking business, understand? Now get out of my face. Okay, so we have over three, two, one. Can we speak to him again? Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> uh, cause information: Rachel and Frank, drugs for sale. Listen, Nathan, I'll take back everything I said about you if you hook me up with Frank. Know what I mean? You look like you've never even taken a hit of baby aspirin. How do you think I stay wired all night studying? So is it a deal or not? Calm down, hard up, deal. You'll get your school supplies. Just go over to Frank and whisper, higher education. You'll hook your ass up. Okay. Holy. I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers. Like a babysitter. Bullshit. My dad doesn't hire. He owns. And these pigs know better than to knock on me. Do they? I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually, he will. Guy's into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for Rachel. Mm. Forget I told you that. Seriously. 
Now get off my crack, whore. Keep your pie holes shut. <sighs> Holy sh! Blood oath? Weren't you supposed to keep your mouth shut about the blood oath Frank took for Rachel? Blood oath? Who? What the fuck? I never told anybody about that freaky shit. Besides, everybody knows Frank is a liar and a loser. Even Rachel did. Yet Rachel Amber hung out with him more than you. Ooh. So, Rachel wanted Frank's stash. She let him take pictures, then he carries around her photo like she posed for love. Dumbass. Dog, this is gross. Holy. This is nasty work. What the freak is going on? Okay. Oh, this is nasty. Speak. What the fuck now? David is after the gun. David Madsen is looking for that gun. He might show up on your RV step. Ooh, I'm trembling. I don't need to take his little museum piece. Okay. Uh, Rachel's photo? You know I saw that photo Rachel gave you. Uh. Uh, how do you know about that? Huh? Chloe, right? She just told me that one of Rachel's favorite pictures was the one she did for you. Really? Yeah, I mean, that's what I thought. She was just a natural beauty, you know? Wait, wait, let me, let me find it. Here, judge for yourself. Okay. Spill... Look. The magic keys to Frank's RV kingdom. Uh. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now. Okay. He brought. Now back to Chloe. Okay. My work here is done here, Frank. Oh, I wanted to see if I can speak to him or something. This is crazy work, dude. Oh, shoot. Like I said, I'm done talking about this. Are you shitting me? All right. Are you shitting Dang, me? Dang, can I get the time to warn her? Golly. Alyssa, watch out. Quick thinking, Max. <laughs> it's like Alyssa. I'm like slowly just like always helping Alyssa. Wait, can I go down here? Nope, I don't oh. want to go there. Sorry. I thought those were the skater guys. I can talk to them or something. Can I talk to you, Alyssa? Whew. That was close, Alyssa. That's the second time you've saved me, Max. Thanks. Don't thank me. I haven't done anything special. You've paid your dues by saving Kate's life on the roof. You really are a Blackwell hero, Max. Uh, Kate's my friend. I'm just lucky. I'm just glad she came down. Kate's a good person. My friend. And she was almost bullied to death by a video. It's fucked up. But you're an amazing friend. I want to make sure she knows how many friends she really has from now on. Amen to that. Max, we should get a posse to see her in the hospital when they allow visitors. Let's hang later and talk some more. Cool. All right, that was pretty cool. Okay, so we did good. Uh, let me just check over here and then we can continue. All right, let's go. RV keys. I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. 
You'll need this, Max. On your mark, get set. Throw! Go towards the road. Go in the parking lot. Get the treat, treat boy. I think we Imagine just made I dog threw it in the road the and he got hit in the f like he got hit. Now he can snoop in peace, but let's not waste time. The dog this is action. busy now, but he might come back. Oh shoot! Okay. I mean, I'm not gonna kill a dog. Max loves animals. Damn! I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast to Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you dare me to drive it like you dared me to kiss you? Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. What was that? I know. What freak was that? Just Daydreaming. Oh, there's dog food here. I think the dog he likes his bone more. Oh. At his computer for info. Steering wheel. Look at this. What is this? Frank is almost a made for TV hoarder. This that would be so cool to take this baby on the road with Chloe. Steering wheel. Baseball bat? I doubt Frank is trying out for the Arcadia Bay Brewers. The archetypal filthy guy dishes. <laughs> Good to know Frank has a knife lying around. It's taken days to download porn. Yuck. Why is she on a uh, dog food? Pompidou? <laughs> for reals? <laughs> That's a poodle's name. Uh, knife things. Baggies. Frank must spend all his drug money on baggies. <laughs> Recycle, dude. Nice rig. Glad Frank treats something here with respect. Of course Frank gets the munchies. Whoa! Crystal, Chloe's gun. Should I give it back to her? Uh, leave, leave the gun. I might regret this, but I can't let Chloe hurt someone. Or get hurt. Um... How can somebody live like this? Yeah, I think us having that gun might just be a bad thing, not a good thing. Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. Prescription pills? Are these for Frank, or is he selling them? Or both. That's a pretty extreme lighter. The vent? Oh yeah, he probably has something in there. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. Yeah. Is Frank going to deal online now? Ooh, Frank's stash. Okay. No more secrets. Uh. Oh, what the hell is he doing with that dog? <sighs> Stop it. Let's check this vet. I could pry this vent open with the right tool. This one too? Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry <coughs> it open. Alright. Let's see if we can find... A tool? Oh, we can take the I knife. I cannot believe he would wear a collar and a furry mask. You're dumb. <laughs> Dog food. Yeah, we should just use the knife, I think. Yeah, okay. Let's just use the knife. 
Or, no. I was gonna say, take the knife. This is almost as good as a set of keys. Let's search in here. My blade will open any portal. Oh, wow. Hold on, before we do that. Oh, we can't even open that one? Why? Oh, man. Rachel and Frank's dog. Yo. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. Frankie B. Loves you always. Heart, Rachel. I hope you read this first thing in the morning. Sorry about last night. I was being a monstrous bee and took it out on you and poor uh, Pompadou. There's a lot of weird stuff going on in my life and sometimes I feel like I'm never going to get out of Arcadia Bay. Thank God for you. Oh, thank God for you. Uh, you're one of the best things I've had or I have here and I smile when I think of us together. Let's just drive out of here uh, forever. So they had a relationship. I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. They were I lovers. I've heard more about Rachel than I want to Ooh. know. Hmm. Trouble in paradise. Frank, uh, that was not cool what you did, and don't blame the drugs. You actually scared me, and I thought you'd never chill out. I've never seen you act that way, and next time uh, will be the last. I'm a Leo, and we don't look back. I care about you, us, so maybe we need to break our routine. XO, wow. Yep, keep that. Thank you. Can we close it? All right. Perfect. Chloe. Oh, wait. Can I use this knife? Max, you didn't tell me you took photos of Frank in action. Ooh, Frank's stash. <sighs> I want to see if there's anything else I can do with this knife because I still have it. Why is Chloe always going on somebody's computer? No prize here. Uh, okay. I think we should be good. It makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years. My mother gloms on a step fucker. Now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. What Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit! You totally defended Step Stalker. Fuck everybody. Chloe! Good thing I didn't give her a gun. That dog would have bite her freaking tail off. Yup. Chloe, you idiot. She, whoa! Freaking Chloe is just stupid. Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. It's nobody's fault. Grow up, Rachel and Frank. It's just life. Shit happens. It's nobody's fault. Blah, 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 as Mr. Jefferson would say. And, and Kate Marsh. Yes, Kate Marsh almost killed herself. Such sad, okay? That doesn't make me feel any better about my fucked She's up She's about to die in a car crash like so your father. Who do you most want to blame? 
Chill out! My fucking dad, of course. Hello? William? You blame William? Really? Yes, I do. Damn right. He chose to go out that door and leave me forever. No, the freak Chloe, he didn't. Your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. You're still here? You don't want to hear this, but you're still here. Alive. With me. And that is no accident. You're right. I don't want to hear this. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me. And Rachel needs you. What the freak, bro? Like, this is what I mean. Like, Chloe is like. She's such a crash out for no reason. We're gonna kick me out now, curse me out. Go ahead. Freaking emotions all over the place, just bouncing over the walls. Relax. All right, Chloe, I don't care. Dang. Like, people can give me the cold shoulder. I'm not gonna freaking sugarcoat stuff because you want to give me the cold shoulder. I'm going to tell you the truth. And I'm glad I didn't give her a gun because she probably would have shot somebody. Oh my god. Whoa. What is happening now? Can she... Go through pictures? Whoa. To find a sweet spot? Use AD keys, life runs, you find the sweet spot. So we're just trying to find, what? Okay, I guess I found it. She can time travel Someday through pictures, bro. Computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Max, tell him. Whoa, hey. You look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah. I just... Uh... Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, Chloe. Give me the thumbs up or thumbs down. Whoa. Well, I might just allow this one into the family album. You're the boss. What is this? But not the cook? William is here. Yes, and we can't Chloe is just a kid. And serve us slackers. Am I that Who's far that back in crates? time? You mean pancakes? In France, they call them. Crates. I'm 18 years old French inside my 13 year old self. If you want to eat How? We. Oui. I volunteer to break the eggs. This is weird. Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. Joyce loves William so much. Dude. That's true. So, how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Man, I remember Chloe reading this. Like you're the real cook here? But not after today. I am when your mom. What a mess we made. Oh. I remember those cool drawings I did with Chloe. Yeah. What the freak, dude? Chloe was so into manga. Nice hair. Oh, look, outside doesn't exist. I know they never took that big vacation. Oh yeah, I miss movie nights here. Cookies Hello. and popcorn. Hey honey, just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. My family never took fun, goofy photos like this. What? Ooh. Oh. I forgot about this. Back to the lighthouse. 
groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Whoa. It's I have to stop William from taking his car today. Me, ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast you upon. You are ridiculous. <laughs> He'll be grateful for that someday. Wait, I can stop Shit, him? Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund. Where's his keys? 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 Uh... Aha! You can't hide There we go. Excuse me, ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags Score. of grub for us to feast you are upon. Ridiculous. <laughs> He'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my Hi, keys? keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Uh all right, so I hit him in the cookies. I don't know if he's going to find them, but we'll see. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. <laughs> oh. I knew this thing would come in handy. How the hell did my keys end up here? And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. <sighs> Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. Dude. All right, we gotta figure out a way to get this. You're bankrupting me. I'm grateful for that someday. Shit, where are Catch my keys? Hide. That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. That should work. I know I had those keys right here. I know it. Forgot all about you, little buddy. Release the keys. Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. You can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh yeah, the bus is great. It comes every 15 minutes and, and there'll be plenty of room for you and, and Joyce and groceries and, and it'll save the environment. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. So if we just change that time period, is everything about... This is gonna mess up everything. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? Whoa! Max. Never Maxine. I know, sorry, Mad Max. You're not pissed at me, right? Right? Do you want to go hit the girl's potty and smoke a peace pipe? I think Max is hot. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, Whoa. you don't want anybody in the club. Like whatever, bitch. 
Warren, he hooked up with Stella? Oh. Oh no, Th this is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Chloe. Yo. Whoa. I feel like they're going to make me go do like a decision where like they want me to either stay like this or that if they want me to switch back. This is nuts. I'm going to be honest with y'all. I'm switching back. So is this place like more lively now? Like, is everything just good now just because his dad, her dad didn't die? So is Chloe actually the, the like, not the issue, but you know what I mean? Whoa, a dead dead whales. Okay, so it's still a problem. No American flag. No red truck. What the freak is about to happen? Why is... Don't tell... Do not tell me that... Somebody's in a wheelchair. There's a freaking um rail outside the house. Somebody's... Don't tell me Chloe's in a wheelchair, bro. Oh my camera died. Alright, you see why we're back? Why you act like you What? Okay. Why do we have a got the rail? You see the you see the rail? That was not here. Hold on. Oh my gosh. Dude. Dude, that is actually crazy. What the freak? That's actually nuts. So Wow. I'm so shocked right now because like I, I swear when I saw that like the little I don't know what it's called but the little handicap rail and stuff and like the little straight path I was like somebody got hurt that's nuts man so you left the money most people stole the money you didn't kiss Chloe most people kiss Chloe you sided with David most people sided with Chloe you kept Frank's dog from harm Frank has David's gun. Okay. Next. Lisa is dead. Oh. The plant. Yeah. 
You didn't help Warren with his exam? Oh, no. You are not on the Vortex Club party list. You didn't change the Vortex Club party list. Oh, I could have changed it. Dang it. You erased the cop's answer phone message? Yeah. You helped Alyssa. You warned the homeless woman. Most people didn't. You didn't take a photo in the past? Wow. I didn't even know you could take a photo at that part. And you didn't leave a mark on the fireplace. So if I would have left the mark on the fireplace, I could have probably went back in the future and seen that it changed. There's so many things like you can do and you just don't see them happening, but I will get back into this on the next episode. We are on episode four, and then after that we have episode five. This is gonna be sick, dude. I'm I can't wait, dude.